today's look I have this Jason inspired mask I saw a girl called Maritza on Instagram I think do it and I was like yes let's do it so if you would like to see how I did this mask you can just keep on watching so this look is simple it's gonna go fast uh, let's go remember to stay hydrated we're going to do a primer just to help protect the skin. And then I'm going to use a NYX Cosmetics. This is an eyeliner. No, maybe lip liner. Yeah, lip liner. That we're just going to use to sketch out the outlines of the mask. So using a brown or light eye, um, eyeliner is going to help you map out without leaving harsh lines. I'm going to use the LA Girl White Foundation just to give the face a white base because the whole mask is basically white just using a little flat brush to carve out the edges then I'm going in with my black water paint from Crayolan and we're just going to map out the eye socket don't get water in your eye and we're also going to use the same black to outline the mask it doesn't have to be too precise because you're going to add shadows as well And I'm using the MAC 210 brush. It's a brush I use to do my eyeliner with. So it has a really flat end. And you can make it even smaller so you can get the nice precise line. Especially when you're doing winged liner. I did add some lashes and a wing with this. Look, I'm also using some brown and black eyeshadow to create a shadow underneath the mask. So it looks like it's sitting on top of my face and not a part of my face. Then just using the same eyeshadows to make the mask a bit darker. This creates the illusion of roundings and dents in the mask. Then marking out the holes in the mask with my same black water paint. Just dotting out some lines of where they should go. Just planning, planning. And then I'll go in and make the circles bigger. Just kind of use a twirly whirly motion. I forgot to block out my brows, so the brows are just filled in with some white paint. And then we're going to create the, the, the red area, so with some red cream paint from MAC Cosmetics and a flat lip brush. I think this is Andrea's makeup brush. Sorry, Andrea. <laughs> I still have it. And guys, that's literally easy peasy lemon squeezy. That is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Let me know in the comments if there's any other creative horror, scary masks or just any kind of special effects videos that you would like to see and I will hop on it now that I still have some free time. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!